Hey guys, Master of Extreme 93, part 53 in Diamond, the last episode. In this part, we take on Cynthia, and I'm going to use my last rare candies on Corion for the final battle. Okay, your mic sounded perfect for that intro. Yay! Luigi's going to be here canaring with me. Yes. Have you been keeping well? Thank you for Mount Coronet. Truly grateful. Together, you and your Pokemon overcame all the challenges you faced, however difficult. It means that you've triumphed over any personal weaknesses, too. The power you learned, I can feel it emanating from you. But that's enough talk. Let's get on why, why you are here. As the Pokemon League Champion, I accept your challenge. Heavy shit spell to go down. Yay. So now this is Cynthia, the champion. Y'all know how like awesome she is. Yes, and opening up with her spirit tomb, level 61, ghost dark type, dark pulse, embargo, psychic, and silver wind. I was thinking she was going to use an embargo, which would totally ruin me, but no. I, I still have to take the thing, I know it's not very effective, but I was hoping for poison hacks, and that's exactly what I got. So she does not use embargo, she uses a psychic. I don't know how I survived this, but I somehow did. No stab and bad special attack. Got myself a defense forward. This is my plan. Now will fall with another turn to let the poison take some more effect with a fly. And hopefully the fly will KO it. This was Silver Wind. Why didn't you use Silver Wind that would have not even KO'd you? I don't know. So now fly hit, I was hoping this would get crater or something or just KO it and sheer power, but not even red HP. And still you silver one. I want you psychic. And that was a <laughs> And that was a critical too. But now look, the poison got her in the red, so you know she's going to get ho and use a former score. I was thinking I'd be able to finish it off with the ace, but no. I pretty much gave up on Kogan, I didn't even try to heal. I knew I would get psychic or something. Now it uses Dark Pulse instead. Still KO's me though. It's probably at any point, Luigi, if my mic starts to act up. I don't want to go two minutes without no narration when I'm talking. It's been fine. It's like been completely fine for all this. Um, wow. So yeah, go die with Surf. Did it die? Yes, it died. Now it's supposed to get out with Roserade. Uh, Roserade is level 60, Grass Poison type with Energy Ball, Extra Sensory, Shadow Ball, and Sludge Bomb. So yeah, this is a pretty much a really good special attack with pretty decent coverage, but it doesn't have anything to answer for a fire type, but someone put out the Fernate just to own it. Well, thanks to its part fighting, it has extra sensory, but you're faster. I'm faster, and it doesn't even use extra sensory. Watch. These parts are always KO, but barely lives. These are Shadow Ball. <laughs> what? Come on, Cynthia, you're supposed to have, like, artificial intelligence at the bazoo. But no, you're, like, not making small moves. So I finish it off with strength. Alright, Gastrodon. Alright, um, if you're playing Diamond or Pearl, this gra Gastrodon is level 60, Water Ground type, Earthquake, Muddy Water, Sludge Bomb, and Stone Edge. However, if you're playing Platinum, instead she has a Togekiss that's level 60, Normal Flying type, Air Slash, Horror Sphere, Water Pulse, and Shockwave. 
Circus Kiss is way more annoying than this thing, because if you have a grass type, they will own it, like, immediately, because it's still weakness. Circus Kiss is, like, a major headache. Amazing. It learns, like, 15 out of the 17 types of moves. Of course, it doesn't KO a physical leaf. It uses Stone Edge Stone Edge. It's a Stone Edge. Poor stored like a hoe. I predicted it was for first so I used Giga Drain! It lives with like 1 HP, I swear to god. You should be able to see the actual HP of the opponent. But now it's screwed, so I'll just use return and go die. Yay. Now it's time for Lucario. Okay, and Lucario is level 63, Fighting Steel type, Aura Sphere, Dragon Pulse, Earthquake, and Psychic. Very this diverse moveset. Very diverse, really good coverage for just about any type of Pokemon. Look, I'm using my Infernape. You think you'll just use Earthquake or something? I use Flamethrower. Does not KO it, but it does damage it pretty well. You have close combat on this Infernape, right? No. You don't? No. Why? Don't ask. But I don't use Earthquake, he uses Aura Sphere. Um, hang on, let me do the math. Yeah, I think Earthquake would have been more effective. But it's still okay though, because you got a great critical hit. They probably would have KO'd anyway. The overkill. This is like the most most awesome prediction ever. It's in range HP, I know that it's going to full score, so use full score. Before calm mind. Yes. Wasted turn for a calm mind now man I'll try to do something. It uses Dragon Pulse. It's not, it, you don't get stabbed, plus special defense raise, it's not gonna do much. Psychic Good Eye. Surprise it was faster. I mean, it's six levels higher, but I think Espeon is like... Oh, <laughs> critical hit! Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Die, Lucario. Lucario got trolled. I uh, trolled uh, Lucario. Super Sleepy Garchomp time! Oh god, Garchomp level 66, Dragon Crown type, Brick Break, Dragon Rush, Earthquake, and Kick It Impact. This thing will rape some serious crap. <laughs> you think? You better hope- oh crap, Earthquake. <laughs> I'm dead. You think? You better, you better hope you got revives or something, cause if you, if you don't got like, something that can- do weakness with ice with like ice move, and yeah, you're screwed. It's also weak to dragon, but not quad weak like to ice. Yeah, ice type will just wait it completely. I'm talking about one hit KO, right? The uh, dragon rush is do a lot of damage, but luckily I get an ice beam off. Yay, go die! It hung on his focus sash. Damn it! I know, it's so Ugh. It with that, the citrus berry. With that amount of HP and then it started to use an item right there, you wouldn't think it was a focus sash. I know. Oh, another dragon rush, so oh crap. The only part of my team that knows the ice type is it's the death. Death? Yes, death. I said that I was a way just to spend some time and use a max variety, because one more ice beam will KO. And there's no way Roserade is faster than that thing. Oh, uh, no way. So yeah, now Roserade's gonna like, you know, bite the dust, because it's not gonna live an earthquake. Yeah, I doubt it's 11 levels higher. <laughs> 
Well, let's sit back out of the on now, so let's finish it off. Before Dragon Rush. <laughs> what? Okay. What? Do you, what? I don't know. It seems like in Diamond and Pearl, the Pokemon are higher level, but the AI is worse than in Platinum. Well, there goes the guy Chomp 5 down, one more to go. And... Yeah, that one more happens to be Milo Dick. Level 63 water type, aqua ring, ice beam, mirror coat, and surf. I can't remember the last time I was put in a corner like this. Well, it sets up that gay aqua ring. But I called that it with toxic. <laughs> <laughs> the emulator cuts off its face. I know. Well, that's no cash for you. I wish I had that smoothie, but my computer does not have enough RAM to keep it, you know. I don't know what I was doing there, but mirror coat fail. Very annoying with the mirror coat, any special attack, it can reflect right back at you and completely own you. So I, I think I remember what I did, I max revived Roserade. But yeah, I switch out before ice beam. You can cool. You actually know. So I can't <laughs> just like wait where's the way from the get go. I don't know these things. This is the first time watching this battle. And what did you do? Critical hit! Yay! Beat it the critical, right? Uh -huh. Alright, so I'm getting a bed now because the video is almost at 15.30, and I'm starting to run out of Pokemon to revive. But I forget! I forget I have an electric type on my team. Duel. Don't worry, I have electric. So, I tr I, this is like the best epic troll move ever. You spark. Right? It's a physical attack. Well, you can guess what you're trying to do. Fear coach. Fear coach. <laughs> You just got trolled, Cynthia. Operating, recover, poison. Okay, you're really weak now, so now I'll finish you off. I won't let this in yet. This match is too fun to let it in so easily. Go, die, and cold die, Thunder Bull. You got waste. I win the freaking game. Come on with focus, Ben. Step down, really. Go, die. We are to win now. And I'm surprised my microphone did not mess up on that video. <laughs> I'm so, I'm so surprised. Champion Cynthia sent out Garatina. That was excellent. Truly an outstanding battle. You get the support of your Pokemon needed to maximize your, their power. And you got it though. With certainty to secure victory. You have both passion and calculating coolness. Well duh, we're both cool. Cool. Together, you and your Pokemon can overcome any challenge that may come their way. <laughs> Calm. Shut up. Those are the impressions I got from our battle. I'm glad I got to take part in the crowning of Samoa's new champion. Come with me, we'll take the lift. Alright. The fall rate sequence of events would be too long to be fit under 15.30, so with the awesome powers of Camtasia Video Screen Recorder, I cut ahead! Yay, cut ahead, put it in. Well, the Skype call recorder thing is just about over it, so... This is Mox signing out for the final time in Pokemon Diamond. I hope you enjoyed it. We kicked serious ass, and my next walkthrough through will be Pokemon Yellow, coming in January. Stay tuned, and I hope you all have fun.